Y'all, look what the scale had the nerve to tell me this morning. Okay, so last month I weighed 169.2. So for all you math majors out there, that's a gain of 4.3 pounds this month. And to that, I say scale boo, okay? You know why? Because I feel great and I'm not letting that number on the scale make me feel any less great about the progress I have made in September. Not this time scale, you're not gonna do it to me. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I know why the scale did that. Uh, a, it's because for the first half of September, I pretty much did the same thing, two week crazy go off plan while I was in New York. But for the last couple of weeks, I have been doing great. I've eaten on plan, I've exercised. Like, I started to feel like myself again, which is so much more important than any number on the scale. And to a lot of people, a four pound gain would indicate that I'm doing something wrong but I know that's not the case. So I'm not gonna let that get me down. I mean, this is just truly a reminder that when you step on the scale, it is merely a snapshot of that very moment. So like I could be feeling bloated or retaining water. Also, I might've gone over calories just a smidgen for my meal prep yesterday but that's okay. And who knows, the scale could be down two or three pounds tomorrow. And if I would have done this video tomorrow, it would have been different. So it's not like this number is an indicator that I'm not doing something right. I am glad though, because I have no more vacations, no more anything coming up for the rest of the year, no more excuses to not be eating the way that I should and to not have my routine. I really love my routine and have come to rely on it. And I don't think that's a bad thing. So look, if the scale's not saying what you want it to say, give it a day or two, give it a week, because it is just a snapshot of that very moment. And there are so many factors besides what you're eating that have to deal with that. Are you retaining water? What's your hormones looking like? How much did you eat the previous day? Like, it's so temporary. The number on the scale is so temporary, but your habits, the things that you do every day to live a healthy life, that is what really matters. And that is why I know that I'm doing everything right. So the scale can eat one because I am nailing it and I feel great. And if you're taking the necessary actions to be healthy for your body, then who cares what the scale says? At least not today. I'll check again in a few days, see what I'm hollering about. But right now, you cannot bring me down because I feel great. And my haircut's looking good. How you doing? What? Yeah, <laughs> don't talk to me about gaining four pounds. Get out of here. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. I do weekly meal preps, weekly full days of eating, and monthly weigh-ins. And sometimes they go my way and sometimes they do not. But that's okay, because I'm still here. You can also find me on Instagram at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks, and I'll see you next month.